The red circle was fun in that it's a riff on the classic nightclub gunfight that you know you see in a lot of these action movies. John is chasing after Yosef in this sequence that is called the Red Circle. Well, the Red Circle, it's like the typical hangout place where all of us Russians hang out. My boss owns the club. It's our money maker. It's where all the young kids hang out, all the women. There's, you know, people dancing and lights and strobe lights. This nightclub actually has a bathhouse below. That's sort of a club in itself. Part of it that takes place in a kind of bathhouse, which was a groovy location. Had some fighting there. <laughs> Yesterday, we actually shot a scene where I come down to the bathhouse, and Yusef, he is just hanging out with his friends. He's getting drunk. He's disrespectful. He's with women. I had to uh, memorize a whole Russian lullaby. Yeah, we sing it in the bath scene. Me and Alfie just full of hot women. We shot the whole day in the hot tub with pretty women in bikinis singing that song. Hey, man. How are you doing? How are you good? Hi. Look at us today. What an upgrade. Hello, Francis. John Wick actually infiltrates the place. On yes. John is playing cat and mouse with the guys down in the bathhouse, and he has a bead on Yosef. <laughs> Joseph escapes. Vigo gives me the order to protect his son. I'm in charge of all the guys, so now I send all the guys after John Wick. John has to chase him up through the nightclub, through the crowd. Vigo has actually laid a trap of the security there that all are armed to the teeth. He's a Move! He's here! He's fucking here! I think the guys did a great job putting it together, and it was a lot of fun doing it. The hardest part about the Red Circle was the location. It, it was, you know, easy to do fights in and stuff like that, but the guys wanted Wick to go over the railing and crash to the floor and won. The ceilings were really low. There was nothing we could rig to, and we had a limited amount of time to get in there. We ended up doing it as a match cut. Basically, the stunt double did a fall over the railing to boxes. We match the fall 
uh, in camera, we pick the stuntman up off the ground on a wire, match his position in the air, and then release him and drop him to the floor. When they just hoisted you up and you're just looking down, and obviously you have some protective gear on underneath the clothes, but when you're hanging about four feet off the ground and they're like, and action. action. Free fall to really hard wood floor. Ideally, they stitch it together in post, and it looks like he went over the railing to the floor. They opened up the cinema of, of the action. You know, it had a lot of long takes and sequences. And because we wanted to show longer takes and didn't want to do what has been uh, more of a shaky cam, more music video style of cutting, cut, 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 cut for all the fight scenes, we wanted to just show off Keanu. We want to see the choreography. We want to see the movement. We want to see martial arts. It's refreshing to see what a human being can do. It's also just an excuse to have fun and have a movie that's a ride.